What's up guys, I'm Shane, welcome back to our North Texas Dynasty. Alright, before we get into the game, as you saw at the top, we've got a crap ton of recruits coming in. Which means that I forgot something in the last episode when I said that uh, we wouldn't have to worry about Emil throwing picks this week. Because we have to pass for 250. Now, don't worry, I'm not benching Emil. I'm not getting into that game again right now. He's fine, it's me, mostly. But, we have to pass the ball this week. I've got an experiment I'm going to do, but we'll do that next week. Now, I was flipping through some of these statistics. Again, Bautista leading the NCAA in tackles, that's fine. Davis jumped all the way up with the last game. Um, I did notice a couple of things around one particular person. Kenneth Dodson has 12 sacks already through five games. He's got 12. Now that's slightly important here and because he can break like 15 records at once if something goes right. As you see down here, the record for sacks in the season is 24. We're on pace to take that record. You know, if we maintain, we're going to have a little over, what is it, 12 and a half or whatever for the rest of the season, so... We technically could do it. I know it's sort of hot and cold, but it's possible. And the career sacks record is 52 way back in whoever that is in Bama. My college football history doesn't go that far back. And right now, Dotson's sitting at 40, which means if he gets 13 more sacks, he will have the career sack record as well as the season sack record. That'd be a hell of a way for him to go out. So let's hope that happens. All right, again, we should be favored in this one, but again, we struggled to stop Kansas State last week. Appalachian State, we've had no problems with in the past, but again, not going to take them lightly. Oh, Iowa State lost last week. That's not good for us. Crap. Oh my god, that was one hell of a pancake there. Who's 78? Oh, Emil, good job. Good run. Well, he fumbled out of bounds. That's what I get for complimenting him before he goes down. Nice snag, Mitchell. Good job. I'm supposed to get 100 yards to a tight end in this game, but it's for a 61 overall tight end. I'm not really worried. Another big catch to Mitchell. Ooh, good truck. Pushed out of bounds. Another snag for Mitchell. Only for four yards, though. Oh, they see what's coming. Doesn't matter. I love this offensive line so much. I'm going to be upset with Clark gone next year, but... Ginsburg is a good backup plan. Everyone else along the offensive line. Serafino's the old man. He's a sophomore. Oh, good counterplay, guys. Good, good job. They got the blocks in the backfield, but he tripped over everyone anyways. And the screen pass shut down. Alright, because we do need yards, I'm actually going to have Weber call a lot of fair catches today. Just until we get there. He's, in, like, he's too good of a returner. We can't get any yards going to impress recruits. No pick six on the sprint out smash. So, improving from last week. And a nice run by Hardy. 12 yards on that one. Good snag by Marvin Harris. I called the wrong play and I wanted to pass it, so I just called four birds and left it as it was. Another good catch by Marvin Harris. And Lane got wide open on PA smash on that one. He's trying to get it to him earlier, so he finally gets that catch. Oh, that guy ran right into me. Perfect. We needed two sacks with linebackers. There's one. And that'll end the first quarter. We're up 14-0. This one doesn't seem to be giving us as much trouble. It's almost like I'm on high alert because I sucked last week. Oh, perfect. I bounced out the right way. Bautista with all three tackles on that three and out. Oh, good run by Hardy. Go, go, go. Nope. Breaks off a tackle, slips off someone else. Huge run. I just need you to get the four, bud. Thanks for that one. 
So guys, I just want you to know that here we are in season five, and I have finally learned how to not just run in a straight line. I'm sure you're all so proud of me. Whoa. And then I wasn't paying attention to the pass rush. <laughs> Total yards 152 to three. Oh, Hardy, I can always rely on you. Like third and 21, and it's... Nah, he'll get open. Oh, Lane again, dashing all the way up to the two-yard line. Oh, wait, I just called a hurry up. I wanted to run the ball, and uh, we don't have a running back. That's all right. Emil can run the ball. What the heck? We have a cannon? I have never seen that before. Have we had a cannon this whole time, or is that new? Did we finally murder the eagle? No, there he is. He's over there. Whoo! That got shut down. Good tackle by Tex Black. And we stopped him short. That's another three and out. Why are you putting no linebackers? It, like, I get it's a cover three, but it's second and inches. You should have someone there. Oh, good truck. That wasn't even me. Hardy just did that himself. Serafino ran right past that linebacker. Watch for man. Okay, so this one, I will not have Simpson open. Yeah. But I do have Harris open. See, I'm learning from mistakes. Every single time I get PA smash in my suggestions, I call it. And I don't know why it's worked one or two times out of like the seven times they've called it. Oh, that's why. Because when it works, it's beautiful. They want me to call fullback dive. Get that crap out of here. Ah, oh, Hardy. I wonder if he gets sick of two-yard runs. Does he, do you think he thinks, like, man, I just wish they would let me get, like, a good toss play? It's not my fault, but I just take what the defense gives me. Oh, that guy got him close. It's third and one. They might get their first first down of the day. I oh, know, the option play worked for him. That's almost as many yards as they had on the day, just on that one run. We already got a shutout this season. Like, we're good. I just, I kind of wish the defensive line could get a sack. Usually these scrambling quarterbacks run right in a Dotson by this point. Come on, guys. We got like a 75 overall defensive tackle we're trying to impress. It's not like there's some scrubs. Thank you! Okay. He caught that so fast that the game didn't even give me control of Cardwell. They gave me, who was, oh, they gave me 36 there. Is that Lewis? Yeah. Okay, good way to end your drive there. All right, you got Harris line uh, matched up with a safety. I'll put Hardy on a streak as well because he's uncovered. Okay, the safety reacted to where I threw the ball before Hardy did. Because there was no one over there. I'm like, oh, let me just lead him over. Oh, yeah, see, he's... That's the problem with throwing to a running back on that one. If that was Marvin Harris, he would have caught that. Oh, well. Let's be honest. You guys are not watching this channel because I'm good. <laughs> it's all good. I see Kyle Shanahan has been running this offensive unit. Just burn out the rest of the clock. Why not? All right, that'll send us into halftime. Up 28 nothing. I'm just, I'm just going to try and get those last few passing yards, and we're just going to run the ball for the rest of the game. Oh, he squirted through all that. Hmm. Yeah, see, usually right there, that's a Dotson sack. Oh, Roden wallops him. Keeps him just short of the first down marker. They gotta go for this, though, right? No, uh... Field goal? Okay. You, you sure about this one? Yeah, barely, but they got it. Alright. There goes that shutout. No, there's 100 yards already. 
I thought that dumb sack would have set us back, but I mean, Emil made up for it. Oh, I, I don't know how Harris got that one, but thank you for getting it. 203 yards now. And again, coach wants PA smash. I waited too long. They are very good at not calling a safety blitz. Which is unfortunate, because that's what I want. The only times they've called it have been when I had a PA Smash already selected, so I couldn't go into four verts anyways. Good catch by Tupin. Ah, nice catch by Mitchell. I don't think we're going to hit the 100 yards with him, but 56, that's respectable. Harris, again, I don't know. That number 25, he never turns his head. We can just throw it right over his head every time. And Emil got injured. We threw the ball away, but they still got him in the backfield. Simpson completely uncovered on that. But, uh, he spun around kind of the wrong way. And Tupin with the easy touchdown. That's 250 passing yards at least, but unfortunately Emil's out. Hey, there's the garbage Dotson sack. All right, bud, 12 more of those and you got every record known to man. Oh, that was an incredible pass breakup by Black. Oh my god, he is huge! I didn't have noticed that. Here, wait, just for comparison. Even though they're crouching, look at how much bigger than Bautista he is. Jesus. And that'll end the third quarter, up 35-3. to three. I believe we have all the yards and stuff like that. And turnover on downs. I didn't even realize it was fourth down on that. I mean, they had to go for it. And it almost worked. I'll leave him out here for, like, this series. Oh, goodness. I ran the wrong way. I'll leave him out here for, like, this series, and if we score again, I'm going to bench him, even if the computer doesn't. I wonder how this counter play is going to work. Oh, that worked real well for once. Okay. Maybe we can add some counters to our arsenal then. Big play Hardy once again. I just wanted to make sure that I was definitely over that 250. We're done now. Oh man, but I really like corner threat. You know what? What is it? Who cares? Let's do it. Good catch by Harris. Nice blitz. Yep, had that red all day. There's our second linebacker sack. I don't know if that linebacker coming in is any good. I think he's like a 68, but we impressed him officially. Oh my god, Dodson! <laughs> that was I don't know why I found that so funny. He just put that man on his back. Oh this punt return is gonna be awful. Oh maybe not. Oh I tried to dive at the end. 60 yard return, but not 61. Oh that was just that was <laughs> Dotson just flattened the right tackle, didn't even break stride, and just broke up that that run. <laughs> oh, that was that was excellent. I can't believe he's only got one sack today. Okay, all the backups are in. So actually what I'm going to do, because you saw my computer, or my PS3, completely uh, die on me, I'm just going to super sim the rest of this one. We'll see how it goes. Eh, they managed to add a touchdown at the end. That's okay, though. Yeah, Hardy, again, play he's just going to be a player of the game every time. Mostly because with Emil, I keep throwing picks. Has he won player of the game every single week? I feel like he has. Okay, that's, uh, that's not a good sign. That green box. Am I about to lose this whole game? 
Uh, I'm not. I'm just gonna jump out of the game and get an auto save. We'll go after the stats later, and I guess I'm not getting a screenshot for this one. Okay, we got an auto save. We're good. All right, so stats of the day: Shaw goes two of two for 11 yards and a touchdown. Emil went two, 22 of 29, 280 yards, one touchdown, one pick. That was me thinking Hardy would react differently than he did. And then, honestly, most of those uh, incompletions were drops. Hardy with 117 yards and four touchdowns. Emil had 34 yards on the ground and a touchdown. And he took a sack, so he'd actually have a little bit more for rushing yards. Marvin Harris, six catches for 93 yards. Mitchell, six for 56. Tupin, three for 22 and a touchdown. Lane, three for 52 and a touchdown. Hardy, two for 50. Simpson, two for 14. Millage, one for five. Peter Smith had one for negative one yards. Hey, you had that great catch last week, so I guess you have to balance it out. Yeah, Millage had a drop, and Lane had two drops. Though, to be fair with Lane, they were all on PA smash, and it was all, like, very well-defended passes. Bautista, seven total tackles. BJ Lewis with five, and Black had four. Bautista with three TFLs. Dotson had three TFLs. Black with one. Hagen and Hayes with one apiece. And Bone Jangles had one. Dotson did get at least one sack, and Bautista had the other two. Cardwell with the only interception. Weber had one punt return, brought it all the way down for 60 yards. We'll jump forward one week, and we'll see if any of these recruits sign. All right, so the 82 overall wide receiver signed. The rest of these guys didn't yet, but we should get there. 75 overall punter. What I'm going to do is actually redshirt him next season. Bracken will be a senior. He'll graduate, and I'm going to take our punter, convert him to kicker, and Higdon will be our starting punter. 72 overall free safety. Hmm, and that's it. I love they still use this Alberting screenshot against SMU. I gotta go through and delete some of these. Regardless, thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked the video, please be sure to hit like down below. If you want to see more from me, be sure to subscribe. Hit that notification bell to get it delivered directly to your inbox every single time I upload. If you would like to nickname any of these incoming recruits, be sure to leave that down in the comment section below. Everything you leave down there, I will always respond to, unless you are the trolliest of trolls. Thank you guys for watching. I'm Shane. I'm out.